I used to have a professor that would say that if you fatigue the body, it releases the mind. So if you're feeling stress or whatever and you get out and you recreate, it helps to make yourself literally happier. My kids love to be outside, so the more time we have outside and the better we have recreational facilities for them to be part of. It gets them out, gets them exercise, gets them moving around, gets them to know the community and people outside of just our neighborhood, which is fantastic for them. Gets them that healthy lifestyle that we want them to lead. For all ages, it's, I think, a definite must. It should be at the top of your list. Uh, Health-wise, especially, you need to get out even from older to the younger. Kids are way too much in front of the TV. And that's never something we've ever wanted for our kids. We, we don't want them to be isolated in their house. We want them to get out. We want them to meet new people and make friends. To understand that this community is a, is a great way to learn from other people and, and build friendships that can last forever. One of the things that I know as a teacher, as a retired teacher, is that kids Oftentimes, they don't know how to play with each other, they don't know how to interact, and this is the perfect way to get them to start. If they had more recreation stuff outside to do athletic-wise, to get them out of the house, away from the screen, and then seniors, the best thing for them is to get out. You know, we could be isolated in our own homes, and um, that's not good for us, especially as we get, it's never good for us but in our later years, we need all the opportunities we can get. When we're going through life, our lifespan, a lot of people get up and go to work in the morning and they have things that they want to do, but we look forward to our recreation opportunities. We look forward to those Thursday night concerts where we can come and hang out with our friends and just hang out or going to the farmers market and picking up fresh produce and talking to the, the farmers and seeing how things are going on their, their end of the world, seeing a different perspective. There's so much that life has us have to have happen and recreation is something we look forward to doing. It uh, gives us a chance to socialize, it, uh, I think it keeps us young. Parks and Recreation Building, they need more room. I mean, during dance classes and stuff, we have parents and kids sitting in the hallways, and it's a mess. Absolutely. I mean, other communities around us have had uh, community centers. There's a small building here we call a community center, but it's quite inadequate now with the population as it has grown. Splash pad, the skating park, the dog park, improving just the, improving just the parks themselves, which I know many of them need improvement. I take my grandkids to some of them, and they haven't had improvements in years. For them to expand the recreation area for everybody in the city, that's a wonderful thing. For the benefit of the entire community, we, we need to be supportive of each other at any age. We have to support uh, new things coming into the city because we want to attract new families. Uh, just like our schools, we have to support our schools because even if we don't have children currently in school, we need to attract more families coming in. My children who are married and have kids didn't look at Sterling Heights to live. They looked at communities where they had a lot more stuff for their kids. It does have an impact. 
I, my, I've always been a Sterling Heights person. I've, I've been, you know, I was born here, been raised here. My wife is the same, but uh, it does have an impact on where we choose to live as well, because we do want those opportunities for our family. You cannot remain stagnant and expect people to just come to Sterling Heights and live. They may, they'll want to come here because of the amenities that we have to offer. We have to support future endeavors to make it better not only for us, but for who's coming in. I think it would be great for the city, for the value of my house, and for the families. I've been really impressed with all the improvements we've been doing here already, as far as the road work, all the way to the plans that are coming in the future and what you've already done here in Sterling Heights. My wife and I are very pleased with what's happening in our city and we're very excited about what's to come. Thank you.